This is 2018 Lexus NX300 first test, all the small things. After a few years on the market, Lexus has decided its now second smallest crossover could use a little pick me up, so the NX is getting a few upgrades for 2018. Look close, though, because they aren't obvious. Lexus also says the 2018 NX300 gets a bunch of new suspension components to improve ride and handling, but to our instruments, it's a mixed bag. We were certainly impressed with the NX300's ride quality, which is properly luxury car smooth. We were less impressed with the handling. Actually living with it, we again come away with mixed impressions. On the plus side, the imitation leather wrapping the seats of our base model NX300 was shockingly convincing. It's soft and supple and looks all the world like the real thing. Although the seats themselves were comfortable, we were less thrilled with their mounting. The driver's seat is very high even in its lowest setting, and because the steering wheel doesn't telescope much, those with short legs will have to really choke up on the dash. The rear seats also sit high, requiring you to climb up into them, being careful to mind your head on the roof. We do like that both the front and rear seats recline. Up front, we continue to be underwhelmed by the touchpad controller Lexus uses for its infotainment system. We're also not enamored with the NX300's ergonomics, as various controls are scattered all over the bulbous sensor stack. In the back, we found the cargo space disappointing for the size of the vehicle. The place to get excited is the spreadsheet. At $36,980 to start and $40,463 as tested, our NX300 was surprisingly well equipped. In addition to the standard safety equipment and imitation leather seats, we also picked up seat heaters and coolers for the front row. Blind spot monitoring, auto dimming mirrors all around, parking sensors, a moon roof, and a power tailgate that opens when you kick your foot onto the back of the car. Although it might not live up to the claims of enhanced sportiness, the renamed Lexus NX300 continues to be a solid luxury crossover and an impressive deal in its segment. We'd like Lexus to have another go at the suspension tuning and maybe give the user interface a rethink for the next model, but in the meantime, it'll serve its target audience quite well.